if you want to create a 3d object from 2d objects you can create a simple 2d object going in 3d you can deselect the points if you want you can come to its settings simply double click and in 3d options you can extrude it then apply as you can see it extrude your 3d object and you can change it um, anywhere that you want nice and here you can uh, see the, if you don't want you can don't see the silhouettes going 3d as you can see the silhouettes the edge up there apply and as you can see you cannot see the silhouettes you can see that change material it's better to see creases with the threshold if uh, you can actually create a 2d object to the polygony object in a 3d if you decrease the number of the thresholds for example a 10 and then apply you can see more edge more polygony edge there or ex extensions there as you can see you can see the edge are ex more extension come from uh, edge of your object <laughs> it looks like a more kind of cartoony shape shading is a tune you can change it you can if you don't you can turn it off it's completely with no shadow and shading or smoothing as you can see smoothly give a shadow to the back of that or tune it's the best thing it's a little shading on that you can change the shading color if you want hatchet you can make it a hatchet one as you can see we have hatched and like send in side color if you want tune another tool for creating 3d is uh, this tool for example we create a new vector reset view going to the 2d and create another object like mm -mm, with our create object simple object with our creation don't want to sharp for example something like this and then uh, we can come to 3d again and you can create an object with that select the layer bring it there you can centralize the origin then you can double click as you can see it's shape change as we have a 3d box here it tells you okay change it to 3d you can again double click on it in a 3d object you can make a lathe object it's create a object based on its origin and revolve it you can apply it here you can see some this this is the inter this section of that is it's based on the center of its layer it's create something like this i think it's uh, based on center of the center of the um, you can see it oh it's based i think in the center of the layer revolve the object you can lace it or you can inflate it boom as you can see we have more inflate object oops you can see 3d nice because i'm very off from the camera you cannot see good here is inflate mode you can change the shading and that's it lace extrude and none you can come back to 2d so that's it if you want you can create a 3d object of 2d or you can directly import 3d object from your 3d software that's it hello my friends to continue these tutorials on youtube subscribe us like us and hit the bell icon and now you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos that we release